Good evening, everybody. We have a four band show tonight featuring my guys in Scarlet King with Burned in Effigy, Heart for Bait, and Resist the Temptation. All four bands are local bands from around here and the greater New York City area. So that is what's on the docket for tonight. It is raining now, which is both bad because rain is always bad and it sucks because it may affect the crowd turnout tonight if it rains again. But the good news is it has been a steady 90 to 100 degrees here in the Northeast for the past couple of days. So the rain has cooled down the air temperature here quite a lot. That is a very good thing. I'm very happy about that. Uh, injury update. The skin infection is completely gone now. So anything that was remaining is now officially gone. I am 100% better. Back at health, I even went to uh, the gym the other day and worked out for the first time in quite some time. So that was wonderful to get back to doing healthy things. Uh, I'm not really gonna go into the stage plot tonight because it is a four band local show, which means they are using our back line. So when the band is all done setting up, the first band I mean, I'll give you guys a tour of the stage layout. But for now, they are still setting up their banners. They're setting up their gear up there. Uh, the first band goes on at 8 o'clock. So for those of you in uh, the past who watched the stream, uh, thank you very much for watching. But I need to get the stream all set up. And it is starting to rain a little bit more. So let's head inside. So for those of you wondering how I do my streams, I got my laptop right here. The software I use is OBS and I basically have a Elgato cam link which is connected to my camera which is a Sony a7 III. I have the USB-C power in there to extend the battery life. The battery in here is charging. I'm going to put it in there right before I'm ready to go live so I have maximum battery life. And basically I set up with OBS and I monitor the stream in, uh, on YouTube Seafall Stream app. The lens I use is a Sigma 14 to 24 ART 2.8. It's a very high quality lens. Uh, it's probably worth more than what I pay in rent for my apartment building, but it's worth it. This is my primary lens I use for real estate and super wide angles. And you guys will see, when you see the stream going on, you see how wide it gets. It's because of this lens. The microphone is a Rode Video Micro. It's simply connected to the camera. Here's a dead cat to remove some sort of uh, aggressive high end and to reduce the noise. But I set the minimum recording at one out of 10, uh, or one out of 20, I think the camera is set up. So the point is, I set up to the bare minimum recording level, and even then, it still comes in really loud. But this is my stream setup. This is what I use to stream. All right, first things first, let's go with that uh, center vocal, whoever's my lead vocal. Check. Check, check. I'm so done with you. God damn. Sounds good. Fucking hey, you can sing. Kick. Snare! Left rack on. Right rack on. Can you give me everything with uh, Tom Phil's place? Like just a simple groove with Tom Phil's? Cool. Thank you. All right, let's hear bass. Are you connected to the uh, cab? 
All right, I'll be there in a second to help you out. Let's hear the guitar then. Keep going, keep going. All right, give me a thumbs up when that's good in that wedge. Cool, and what was that fuzz I was just hearing? All right. All right, keep going, let me hear it. Switch that off. Is there any way to move the volume up on that? Cool. That's good. You can hear yourself okay? Yeah. Okay, drums, you need to hear bass? A little bit? Smudge, okay. Keep going on that bass. Cool. All right, guys. Let's see. Let's get all the instruments and run through like half a verse of a song, just so everyone can hear themselves okay out there. Sound checked and ready to go, guys. So here is the amp in question that was causing the problem. So this is a uh, Ampeg Portal Flex. So the issue wasn't her connection to me. The issue was her connection to the speaker cab. There's an issue with her speaker output right here. We tried both uh, classic speaker output and quarter inch output and on both the cab. And for some reason, the connection with her amp is the problem because we we one of the bands was kind enough to let me use his uh, backup bass amp here and this connected to the cab just fine it produced sound so the issue is not the cab the issue is her connection uh, her output um, I tried all the knobs I tried all the combinations I could back here all the options back here are for the direct signal to me so there really is no option to fix this here. She has to get the amp service to get her speaker outputs fixed. So, like I said, we tried traditional speaker cable input. We tried her quarter inch input here to the quarter inch input here. And for some reason, it just didn't work. So the amp sounds great. There's nothing wrong with the direct signal coming to me. The issue is with her cab uh, with her speaker output to her cab connection. And this is a good cable because I just tried this on this amp along with the quarter inch output and it worked fine. But Christ averted, she can hear herself okay, that's all that matters. We're not using stage right guitar cab. We have our drum set ready to go and then we have one guitar player right here. So, who I believe is also streaming too. So, hello, guitar player streams. Uh, we have a wonderful EVH 5150 over here, and it sounds fucking great coming through the cab. So, we're ready for a show. We're ready to kick ass. Let's go to it.
while she sits out in the sun baked and fried Slathered in sugar coated things Smothered in fermented wine Yields to a toxic disease
Hands always full. The father is my will. The cat has shot a woman all. To break the seas into the midnight. To try the land. I do submission. To aid of all is the goal. Under the midnight. Set a mission done. Birds of the sun. Wait for the law. done here had a phenomenal show musically tonight and it was what I feared like we had a really bad rainstorm right before the show started so that really prevented some people coming out tonight and uh, oh, oh I know I, I see I see you guys are still loading out so yep you're good No worries, uh, you're good. I also found out tonight that um, I think uh, Godsmack and Stained are playing the PNC Arts Center, which is a good 30 minute drive from here. So I think if uh, those things weren't happening, the crowd would have been a little bit bigger. Show must go on, as they say. Musically, though, the fucking bands all killed 
tonight. Resist the Temptation, my God, that woman can fucking sing. I was so impressed with her voice. She was so, so good. Um, and then Scarlet King, those guys, they're always welcome here. They always kill it here. Their new song was killer. I loved their new song. I appreciate bands like Scarlet King that know how to dial in their tones. They take direction. They don't like give me any fucking attitude with uh, if I need to ask them to adjust their EQ. They're good. They're just great. They're a great group of guys and they always they always kill it on stage, man. Again, I just I can't go into enough praise for how good that band is. And everyone else tonight just what what a great job by every band overall tonight. Really, really made me happy as a sound guy. There's no one else here. We're all wrapping up, so this is my cue to get the fuck out of here. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.